What the- what? How dare you? What the he- what? Oh. What? Hello everyone, my name is Gracie and this is episode 6 of Viewfinder. Fantastic puzzle game. It is not super challenging, but it is super fun because of the manipulation of the uh, world. Kind of like Super Liminal where most of the game was fairly easy. It was just really a fun experience to play it. So if you're enjoying what you see, definitely go out and grab it for yourself. Support the devs or tell friends about it. Um, or at least tell them to watch my videos if they just want to see the game being played. Um, so we're headed up into the, what, the roof? The attic? Oh, I'm supposed to go, oh. Okay. Does this machine you're looking for really provide all the answers? If so, I wish that for all our troubles. Well, yeah, I mean, the goal. One simple solution, and our worry is gone. Hmm. I thought that would sound happy, but it just sounds... <laughs> Never mind. What's wrong with you? I said my piece. Looking back, these last few sessions have been the most difficult. <laughs> and the most fun I've had since I can remember. Every corner of this place is an expression of some dream one of us had. That's... that's gotta be something, right? Kind of like a stored piece of memory. <laughs> Just like Miran's photographs. No. Next area. Oh. It's... I don't like that. A little spooky. I got all the Mahjong tiles, apparently, even though I definitely feel like I did not. Where does that go? I might have to bring up the shadows when I... Oh, got some weirdness there. Yeah, I might... Bring, okay. Sorry, I like that kind of broke my brain for a moment. <laughs> what the fuck am I? Okay, <laughs> well, all right, I'm not going that way. All right, back the. But, but... But... Uh... What the f... Oh my god. It just looks like it's a full... No, it doesn't. It's... The perspective's all scrunched up. What is happening? Is this the code corrupting they were talking about? It's a bit clever, isn't it? See, Leung was always fond of games. A good puzzle to keep himself busy. His workspaces were no different. Look at that over there. Oh yeah. I also don't have my camera, which is interesting. Uh, um, I thought we came together to compare notes. I don't have anything new to share. Are you sure? There's always something new to explore here. Nothing of value yet, but soon. That was a nice idea, Aaron. Relaxing even. Thank you. Uh, but don't you think it's time we got back to work? I still don't have a camera. It's getting quite dark. It's still beautiful, but it's definitely taking on slightly ominous tones. This is a disaster. I need to speak with Miriam before this gets any worse. Where has she been anyway? She's so busy with her work, I haven't seen her outside her space in a while. I'll, I'll give her a call. This can't go on. I don't know what what's happening. 
Just his sunglasses. That's how we know he's been here. Oh, weird. What the hell? And then you're like, oh, there's no stairs here, but there is... What in the world? So... There's, like, perspective fuckery going on here. What the... What? How dare you? What the he... What? Oh. What? Oh my god, that was not there. That's so weird. So then you come back over here and you're like... What? Nope. Okay. I thought it was literally telling me to just fly, like just trust my instincts and fly, but I'm maybe if I jump off of there. Ah! Filtration system proofs for a uh, lung. Uh, disassemblage number 226. Who was it who said insanity is doing the same thing over and over and expecting different results? What is going on with these people? They are losing it in here. I don't even know what happened. So I go around and then around the far corner. Okay, well. What? Oh, the, oh, the pillars. Okay, okay. So go in the start, go around the rightmost, through the middle, around the upper left. Okay, okay. And then that's going to cause something to be here. I feel like the program. I feel like the programmers are showing off now. <laughs> this is super cool. Storage locker one B, one C, one A, one C, one A, one A, one C. Okay, so they've got all. So why are they packing up and leaving now? What happened? Did they solve the problem? Would that have been different if I had gone around the other way? It's a question mark there. It's like, we don't even know what happened. All right, let's go this way. Yes, it did. Oh, weird. So I have to go, I have to not inspect that thing yet. I've got to take a photo of it first. They tricked you into thinking there's nowhere to go. Oh my God. Oops. Sorry, I... Yeah, yeah, give me those, please. Thank you. Hopefully they don't mess with me on this. Well done with that. <laughs> Why walk when gravity do trick? Then why did I have two photos? Don't you find it fascinating? Are the solutions our minds can cultivate when given the space and motivation? 
They, uh, they might not always be perfect, but they are special. You're special. Am I supposed to leave now? Oh, goodbye, cat. Uh, am I done here? The machine you're looking for. Is that the only chance you have? The only solution your mind has decided upon? Huh. Then there's only forward, isn't there? Let's do... Night vision, weird. Let's do um, color shift two, that seems fun. I don't know if that'll persist in the next area, but we're gonna find out. Um, okay, interact. So we have completed Yi, Yi Lung, Hiraya, Aaron. So this was the painter. This is like the botanist, maybe? Maybe? Mirren is the person putting it all Mirren's together. workspace awaits. She's rather special. The one who started all of this, with good intentions, no less. She even made me, and for that, I will always be thankful. Even though she... <clears throat> well, she really loved this place. Is this just fantasy, or did we go to other planets and moons and stuff? That sound effect is so good. Oh my god, it's perfect. It's like wearing your galoshes through the rain. All right, hello. Um, the yeah, I don't know that stuff. Okay, yep, she's uh, math. Oh, kitty. Oh, she's got some wieners and pudding, cookies and tea. Hi, kitty. Yeah, so this is the next one. Well, I want to look around a little bit. Prototype 1, prototype 4. Wind control. Need more trials. Um, that's a... Fond of this structure. It makes me feel tall. Higher and higher we go. It's a cat tree. He's got a little kitty tree for himself. Oh, what a, what a guy. Who's this? I got a picture of somebody. Oh, you got a little outside area. Uh, well, I, oh, what, is that eggs in potatoes or bread? I'm unfamiliar with this food. Briefcase. Is this all you can come up with? All right, let's go look outside a little bit before we do uh, one of these sections here. Oh, cookies. Oh, what a cool area. It's cool that this is an observatory. Very scientific. Oh, there's a ladder up there. Or a staircase, sorry. Cool. So maybe we can go to the top of the observatory. Let's go on in. How are we doing on time? Pretty good, got lots of time. Okay, I've got my trusty camera back. Kate. Um, okay, so I got my camera. I need to find two batteries. There's a battery. Those structures back there, they eluded Mirren. Unusual things, but useful in their own way. I wonder how you'll navigate them. What do you mean? These? What are you talking about? Hey, what's this? What to call this violet infection? Why? Well, I, I mean, I don't need that battery, right? I've got... It appears to be spreading. I am not concerned. Violet infection? Okay, well, maybe that is a problem. That is kind of a lot of... These look like succulents. What the heck is going on? Well, what? why is there a battery behind the wall? Can't I just take a photo of this one and leave?
Oh. Yeah, the phone never rings anymore. Ominous. Am I trapped in here? Well... I mean, I don't see why. Does this battery not work? No, it does work. Strange. Well, now I feel like I have to go. Oh, there's a little area up here. I've been staring at the wall for hours. It's quite beautiful in the way that it closes upon the sky. If you know where to look, you can already see that there will come a day when the blue skies we take for granted are gone. Replaced by some other darker color. I know it in my heart of hearts. But there's something hopeful about that purple. At the very least, it's not red. There is a lot of purple in here. So what the heck's going on with this area locked up? I gotta figure this out. Um, give me some empty space, please. Oh, that's weird. What the... What the hell? Wait, there's so... So there's corruption in the data. I can't take... What the heck? Oh, it's moving. Ooh, hey, don't do that. Oh, don't change. Weird. Okay, I want to. I want to get to that battery without destroying it. What a strange situation we have here. Okay, so this is this is the violet infection. It's actually fucking with the code, so it actually is a bit of a problem. So if I take a photo of only, I just get sky. Weird. Bye, cat. All right, well, I'm gonna take my two real batteries to the pad because I don't need no fake copies. <laughs> you figured out. Lurin would have been impressed. Wait, 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 wait. Are you saying I can't take a photo of this battery? Oh, of course. I accidentally figured out. <laughs> I thought I was so smart. Oh. Fuck. Uh, oh, God. oh, God, why? No, don't, oh, it's weird. It's like a code tryptophobia. Ah. I didn't beat the infection. I transformed it, making the violet work for me in ways that can, will change everything. I've spent days playing with it like I did the first block set Mum gave me as, gave me as a child. The kinematics of what I've created are mind-blowing. I've always told myself that people will only flock to you once your work truly pushes the boundaries of what they think is possible. With the Violet, we can do that and more. We can show them how to build new realities. With a substance that breathes like a living organism, replicates with all the elegant momentum of a machine, but doesn't destroy unless we want it to. I have to do big things with the Violet. It's too monumental a discovery not to put it to good use. This is incredible. The system is self-learning, ever-growing. It can be used to build structures, new buildings, supported on its own energy. This could truly help push the principles of my research to new heights. I need to show this to Araya immediately. What a fond memory. Mirren was so excited about her work. Ambition is an infectious thing. What in the hell? Hey. I wonder how we're going to reach that teleporter. I know. <laughs> Never mind. Um, what? So all of these things in the distance this whole time have been these violet fucked up towers that do something. Violet air filtration architecture. Oh, film. No, I can't. Oh, I gotta fall inside there, maybe? Incredible how it breathes. No, I don't. I actually hate it. Personally, not not a fan. What the hell? Oh, it's so weird. Oh. Stop making sounds as I move. You're freaking me out. Ugh. Oh, God. Okay. 
All right, make me a Rubik's cube. Oh. Thanks. This is useless. <laughs> Can I pick up this? Oh, look at this tart. Get out of here. Go. Oh, I need to use this to climb... Ah, this thing, probably? Oh, photo. Well, um... Very weird. Okay, I've got one film. I'd like to take this, I'd like to make multiple Rubik's Cubes, please. Ah, there it is. Another brilliant workaround. Oh, I've got a Nega Rubik's Cube. Wow, this is extremely colorblind, unfriendly. I prefer you, regular. In fact, you know what? You can. You, this is an abomination, and you're going in the pit. And you're coming with me, sir. Hell yeah, we're gonna be friends. All right, let's go. Just pretend. Just pretend it's coming with me. Where's that ringing coming from? You made it! I'm so happy. Nice work. You're near the end of this wild maze. At least, as far as I can tell. The weather disruptor must be around here somewhere. It's Marin's life work, right? She must have stashed it away. Find it, and let's get you out of there. The I... weather disruptor. Marin's life's work. I see. Mirren and the others developed a lot of potential solutions for your current climate worries. I'm sure one will be useful. Yes, I'm sure. I think she started losing it and building this weird purple Lego hell. Appreciate the view. You made this, you can master anything. I... oh, that's where I need to go. Okay. Broken, revisit later. Oh, these are weird. What are these? They're like chopped up butts with flowers growing out of them. Purple violet succulents. There's a photo over there. I... How can... How high can we reach? Not even the sky can limit us. Is that a clue? Well... I need to get that photo. But I don't know how. Oops. <laughs> Step off the edge again. Well, shit. Hang on. I'm going to go find a photo or something. I never went in this little room here. I'm sure you noticed by now, but using film was always Mirren's idea. One of her many passions. It's a bridge. Okay. Well, I need a bridge to get to that other photo. Multiple bridges. Okay, I know how to use that. I'll go over here and line it up, I think. But then I, I won't have enough... Um, I won't have... That's pretty good. 
Hopefully there's another photo or I'm st or I'm stuck. That's so weird. Camera. Uh okay, well. There we go. Hey, kitty. Okay, let's listen up to this. Looking around me now almost feels like seeing into the future. How exciting to think that one day our cities could look like this, could breathe like this. It's never too early to change the world. No, Mirren, this is terrible. I hate everything about this. <clears throat> this violet stuff is... No, no, don't. Ugh, okay, gross. You remind me a lot of Mirren. You know, always taking new information, mastering it quickly. Ingenuity. From what I've gathered, having a passion to strive forward is the first step to accomplishing many things. I love when this cat tells me that I'm smart. It's my favorite thing. All right, I think we've got time for one more. Depends on how long it takes. I always love to research corners. I've got five photos, but I think... Wow. Okay, I can't take a photo of any part of that. Well, what's this? Huh. Why do you have a small table out here? Goodbye. Ah. <laughs> I Not only can I not get back, but I also accidentally fell off because I'm... Guess I'm silly. All right, what is? Oh God, these are horrible. I hate you, Violet. Uh, Object fourteen, Violet Rise project. This might be the one. Violet Rise seventeen, fourteen, thirty-two. Object thirty-two slash Violet. Rise. What is this? Object. What do you mean? What is it? All this work. I see now that it's only part of the solution. What we need is a grounded catalyst that can place full control over the atmosphere directly into our hands. A machine to offset the RISE project's nitrogen emissions. The missing piece of the puzzle that will bolster the architecture's weaknesses. Kate, can you archive this batch of results? I've a brilliant idea that I need to diagram. So she's really just going full, full on this Violet project. Your discoveries will be published in a revised edition someday. So apparently their weather thing has some side effects and she's thinking this will fix that, which is possible, but I don't know what's going on. Useless junk for Leung to play with. There's small table hidden out. There's another one down there. What on earth? There's one up there. Huh. Um, okay, well, I, I, oh, is that a panel for me to read? No, it's a gap. It's a square-shaped gap. I'm an idiot. All right, I, oh. Oh my god, that's so weird. That's so strange. That's really freaking me out. Can I take a photo of it like this? Yup. <laughs> Damn it. Get, get. Yes! I'm a genius! <laughs> Alright, let's call this episode here. That was really fun. Oh, what? Oh, we're back to like regular stuff. I don't know, there's a little bit of that purple crap. Okay, we're mostly back to normal now. Just a little bit of this infectious violet structure that I don't like. And apparently all of these things in the distance are those freaky towers she's been building out of nothing. All right, well, let's end this episode here. I want to thank everybody so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this playthrough so far. It got a little bit more interesting, didn't it? Because this is uh, not something I feel like we should have in the real world, which is a self-replicating, breathing metallic structure. Weird. Alright, so thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Check the link in the description for my Patreon if you want to support the channel to help me make more awesome series like this. And I will see you in the next episode. Thanks again for watching.